Hello everybody! Last month, I went on a double date. My first ever double date, actually. It wasn't one of those weird blind dates. I went with my boyfriend and my best friend brought her boyfriend. Then when I got home, I thought, oh, what a great idea for a video. How to double date. First thing that I noticed that I was very glad that I planned out was activities. You know, we went bowling and then skating. Some people go on double dates and like, go off for dinner and then end up having awkward dinner conversations or there's awkward silences because no one has anything to say. Although that usually happens when most of the people there don't know each other and in my case, I mean there was me and my best friend who knew each other. We were all four of us were pretty talkative so that went fine. Next thing you must not do when you are double dating is having inside jokes and laughing on inside jokes with the person you're with. That just brings along more awkwardness. Like, the other two people are just gonna be sitting there awkwardly, just like, um, what? And you and your partner are just gonna be laughing your asses off, excluding the other two. One thing that, I mean, you can do, but try to limit it to, like, not too much, is making out. Don't start making out with the person you're with in front of the other two, or, or like going in a corner and making out. Don't do this, especially if the other people you're with didn't know each other before the date or aren't dating. A double date is kind of for everyone to mingle together, and if it's their first time seeing each other, it could be really awkward because they're just like, they don't know how to mingle together. Something a lot of people do, actually I think everybody does, is compare themselves to others. And when you're double dating, you're gonna see how the other couple interacts with each other, and then you're going to compare it to how you and your boyfriend or girlfriend or friend or whoever you're with interact with each other. You'd be like, wait, why aren't we more like them? But don't go comparing yourself to other couples because everyone is their own little unique couple. And that's what makes it awesome, that you don't look, act, and are like other people. And like any how-to should end, have fun! Because what is a double date with no fun? A boring double date. And no one likes boring double dates, obviously. I hope this how-to was uh, informative and educational. I'm hoping I will help all you double daters have less awkward double dates. I will see you all next week because yes, I will do my best at getting back on the schedule. Bye!